My name is uh, Adam Dash. Uh, I'm 53 years old. I um, am an independent insurance salesperson. I used to have hobbies when I was physically able to do so, like play recreational sports, uh, but I haven't uh, been able to do that for a long time because of my, because of my mobility. I had unexplained uh, right leg weakness uh, back in 2009, and I went for multiple uh, doctor visits. I went to uh, physical therapy. I went to an orthopedic. Uh, and then when the orthopedic can't help you, they send you to the neurologist. And I had a brain MRI. And that's when they told me that I had uh, MS. And I had uh, textbook uh, symptoms. I had uh, right leg weakness. I walked with a chronic limp. I had uh, fatigue. I was looking for my symptoms to be reversed and have normalcy again in my physical being because uh, I could not even walk to my mailbox. And uh, that was, um, saying it was upsetting is, is an understatement. When I was diagnosed and I um, realized and understood the condition that I had, I did a lot a lot of my own personal research. The only thing that ever seemed to help people were, were stem cells, except nobody was you know, doing, doing the treatment or successfully. So I found the uh, Stem Cell Institute, um, I think it was about 2011. I came across the YouTube of uh, Neil Riordan and uh, Dr. Paz and uh, I must have watched the video, no exaggeration, at least 60 times. And I said, this is, you know, this is something I have to, uh, I have to give a try. I'll never forget the first time I came, um, there was somebody that met me at the airport. Um, they greeted me at the airport. They took me to uh, the VIP lounge to, you know, to sit and they retrieved my luggage and they provided me uh, transportation to the clinic. And wherever I went or during that time, um, the transportation was always spot on. It was always on time. And uh, that was reassuring. Yeah, well, the aha moment for me was uh, after my first treatment, uh, not only could I not walk without a cane, uh, but I couldn't spread my toes. And I'll never forget, um, it was either the first or second night after my treatment, um, I started getting uh, pulsating feelings in my toes. And I was able to slightly start to spread my toes, which blew my mind. It gave me hope. It gave me hope that, you know, maybe there's a uh, there's a light at the end of the tunnel that, and I was never really, I, I could never run marathons to begin with, even before, you know, my symptoms happened, but I was just looking to, uh, I was just looking to get a normal, um, you know, routine of life. Hopefully, uh, maybe one day soon, I could, uh, you know, pick up maybe a recreational sport like, uh, like golf or something. One of my doctors used to say, you know, what we're trying to do is, you know, put the odds in your favor. There's no guarantees of anything here or in, in life in general. However, uh, I think if you want to try to put the odds in your favor to get improvement uh, for your autoimmune condition, that this is, um, you know, I think this is the best chance you have.